we don't have many spaces like this inside the perimeter. I mean, this is unique. I kind of think it, it, it beckons you just because it is. And it's, it's, a, it's a quiet, peaceful place. You know, it's a kind of a contemplative place. I think that's what makes it great. Park Pride's been great. I mean, we could not have achieved anything we've achieved here without Park Pride. I think coming here and getting that connection to nature is so vital. I think we are nature deprived. You know, I do think coming into the park will actually improve your health, even if we're only aware to the extent that, gee, I feel peaceful when I, when I walk in a place like this. But it actually what, you know, is affecting us mentally and emotionally is affecting us physically. What's really neat is we get people of all ages here, you know, families with itty bitty children, some and, you know, baby joggers, and then just adults. Um, kind of free exercising through here. A lot of runners would get a lot of joggers. Just regular, you know, steady use, and it's all movement oriented. Certainly, um, uh, a strong case for why we need these kinds of spaces and why we need to to protect and preserve more of them because really our health depends on it. Park Pride, 30 years for the greener good.